welcome to today's class good day uh, today we're going to be taking qu uh, past questions on jam under standard form uh, we've treated the topic standard form and also which is under approximation we treated the significant place system uh, significant figures system we've, we've treated the decimal place system and this is a standard form uh, system. So we treated the wired pass question on standard form. Now this is the jam pass questions on standard form. Uh, so here we have a question from jam 2016, question 22. Now it says simplify this, leave your answer in standard form. So what do we do here? Let's solve this together. So we have a what? 0 0.026 times 0 0.36 divided by 0 0.69. So here we can simplify this as what? Move our, our decimal place in three places. Remember when I told you when we move our decimal place to our right, it would result to a, a negative power of 10. So if we move here, 1, 2, 3, we have what? 26 times what? 10 raised to the power minus 3. If we move here, 1, 2, we have what? 36 times 10 raised to the power minus 2 over. If we move 1, 2, and we have what 69 times 10 raised to the power what minus 2. So here to simplify further, what do we have? We have what 26 times 36 times 10 raised to the power minus 3 minus 2 over 69 times 10 raised to the power mi minus 2. Okay, here something can cancel out. Uh, I think 3 can go here 12 and 3 here 23. And if we multiply this. We are going to get a 312 okay 26 times this okay let me quickly do this here you know in jam there's no calculator so you have to be fast you know this is a uh, 2 1 and this is uh, uh, 4 plus 1 that will give us a what 5 this is 6 and this is a what 2 when we add this when we add this what do we get we get a what 2 1 3 okay so we're going to divide uh, uh, so we are left with what 312 over what 23 times this is times 10 raised to the power minus 5 over uh, times 10 raised to the power what minus 2. So let's do a long division of this. So we have what 312 dividing 23. Now, how many times would uh, 23 go into 312? Let's say if it would it would go. First of all, in uh, in 31, it will go 1 times. 1 times this will be, give us what? 823. We must remember our long division here. So to subtract this, we will borrow a 1 here. 11 minus 3 will give us what? A 8. And what do we do? This is 2 left here. 2 minus 2 is a 0. We we'll drop down our 2. How many times did 23 go in uh, 82? It will go how many times? 3 times. 3 times this is what? 69. Let's subtract this. What do we have? We have a borrow 1, 12. 12 minus 9 is what? 3. We are left with 7 here. 7 minus 6 is 1. What do we do next? So with 23 going 13, no. So we drop down the 0 and there will be a dot here. Put a dot here, drop down a 0. And 23 in 130 would go how many times? 5 times. 5 times 23. What are we going to get? That will give us a 5, carry 1, that's 10, that will be 11. Then we'll subtract this, borrow 1 here, we have what's a 5 here. What's left here? A 2, 2 minus 1, that will give us a 1, we'll drop a 0. 5, uh, 23 in 150, it's going to go like 6 times. When we multiply this, we have what? An 8, carry 1, that's 12, 12 plus 1, that will be a 13. And I think we can stop here. So we are left with now uh, 13.56 times 10 raised to the power minus 5 minus minus 2. So what do we have here? We have 13.56 times 10 raised to the power minus 5 plus 2. And that will give us minus 5 plus 2 is what? It times 10 raised to the power minus 3. That's 13.56. Now you can see an option here. Um, our option is um, the decimal point is here, so we have to uh, shift this decimal point one place. And I told you when we are shifting a decimal point to our left, 
we'll add a word plus one so this will give us a 1.3 times uh, uh, this will also approximate to this which will give us a six times 10 raised to the power what's minus two this is our answer so what's our right option here option d our next question is from jan 2015 it says simplify this all we need to do is shift our decimal place so how many times are we one two three four five so we have six two five times ten is power minus four minus what five since we're going to the to the right so we add minus five we have we're shifting this how many times one two three four so that would be minus four so we have over 25 times what 10 is power minus six minus four so here 25 here one 25 here how many times is still 25 so what are we left with this is a nine so we're left with what 25 times 10 raised to the power, this is minus 9, and this is a minus 10, so it will be minus 9 minus minus 10. What is this? This will give us 25 times 10 raised to the power, this will be a plus, what, 10, so it will be what? 10 raised to the power minus 9 plus 10, and which will give us what? A 1, that's 25 times 10 raised to the power 1. Here, our answer is given in 2.5, so we move how many places? We move to the right one place and when we move we add the word one that'll be a plus one so our answer is what 2.5 times 10 raised to power 2 and our right option here is option a our next question is from jam 2000 uh, jam 1999 question 9 it says simplify this so what's our solution here so we have let's shift this how many times one two three four okay so we have what uh, 23 times 10 raised to the power minus four then let's take this side this take this uh, a decimal place here so we have what times what 75 times 10 raised to the power one since we're, move, uh, we're moving to the what right uh, left i mean so here we go one two three four five so we have 3, 4, 5 times 10 raised to the power minus 5. And we'll go here 1, 2. And that's times 1, 2, 5 times 10 raised to the power minus 2. So what will happen here? We have, let's take our 10 to this side. We have 23 times 75 times 10 minus 4 plus 1 divided by 3, 4, 5 times 1, 2, 5 times 10 minus what? 5 minus 2. So here, what do we have here? We can cancel out. Remember our square root is still here. 23 will go here. 1, 23 here will go 15 times. Uh, what else? Uh, 25 will go here 3 times. 25 will go here how many times? That will give us a 5 times. And 3 here, 1. 3 here, 5. So we are left with what? 1 over what? 25. And this is what? That's times 10 minus 4 plus 1 that will give us a minus 3 minus 5 minus 2 that will give us what a minus 7 so it will be what minus minus what minus minus 7 so remember our square root so we have 1 over 25 times what is minus minus 7 that's minus 3 plus 7 and minus 3 plus 7 is what 4 4 okay so we're left with this so what is uh, 10 raised to the power 4 10 raised to the power 4 is what this right divided by 25 25 in 100 will go four times so we have we're left with 400 so this is equal to square root of what 400 what's the square root of 400 the square root of 400 is what 20 so what's our right option here option b our final question is from jam 1997 question 3 it says find the value of this plus this this raised to the power 3 plus uh 0.0 raised to the power 3 in standard form so this, what do we do? We shift this how many times? Three times. So we have six times what? Ten raised to the power minus three, all into bracket three, plus bracket. Shift this how many times? One, two, three. We have what? Four times ten raised to the power minus three, bracket three. So this three will multiply everything in this bracket. So we have six raised to the power three times what? Ten. If we multiply this, we have a minus nine plus four raised to the power three times 10 raised to the power what minus 9 so let's solve this what's 3 raised to the power 6 
that will give this 6 times 6, 36 times another 6, we have what? A 216 times 10 raised to the power minus 9 plus, this will be 64, that's 6 times 6, 4 times 4, 16 times 4, that will be 64. So 64 times 10 raised to the power what? Minus 9. So here, what do we do? We simplify this further. Let's move this 1, 2. We are moving to the left. So if we move this 1, 2, that's 1.16 times 10. 10 raised to the power minus 9 plus 2. Then plus. Let's move this one time uh, two times 1, 2. So we have 0 0.64 times 10 raised to the power minus 9 plus 2. Okay? So here we have what that's what we're trying to do is leave it in the same uh, leave it in the same power. So this we are left with what 2.16 plus 0.64 or into bracket times 10 minus 7 because minus 9 plus 2 is what minus 7 and minus 9 plus 2 is 7. So everything would multiply what's in here. So when we add this, what do we have? 6 plus 4, that's the 10, carry 1. 6 plus 1 is a 7 plus 1, 8.2. So we have what? 2.16. 8 times 10 raised to the power minus 7 and our answer is what option c so thank you for staying tuned to today's class see you in our next video tutorial class thank you bye